On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. Hey guys, welcome back to another Vlogmas. So today is Saturday and I'm having a bit of a lazy day because I'm not feeling too, too great. My throat is a little raspy and I just feel like I'm getting a cold. Hopefully not. I'm having, I'm drinking some emergency here. Um, and I'm wearing Mickey ears or mini ears because I just filmed my giveaway winners on Instagram. So if you enter my giveaway, make sure to check the video and make sure to check my Instagram. So I don't think today is going to be a very exciting day. I'm mainly going to be staying at home. Um, my husband went to pick up our mail right now. I have four packages, so I'm pretty excited to see what I got. And right now I'm just sitting here editing. I'm editing the video from yesterday. I'm gonna post it up in a few minutes. It's a little late today, but actually yesterday we were out as you're gonna be able to see in this video and we got home a little late, so I was pretty tired. And again, I'm not feeling too, too great. So here's the hubby back with some paquetes. That one is from Disney. Then I got this one that he already opened and they are pins. I'm gonna show you that. This, haven't opened it yet, but seems like they're pins. This, I don't know what it is. This is from Ulta. I will show you that too. So let's start opening some boxes. Yay! So let me show you the Disney stuff. I think it's pretty funny that Disney actually ships everything like little by little. So I just got this that I actually uh, purchased for um, donation. Like I want to donate it for kids this year for toys. I got a few pins. Um, I'm waiting for one more box of, uh, not these, but another box from, um, it's the Small World Holiday Pin Box. This one got a little messed up in the mail. <laughs> but these pins I love, love, love. And then I'll, I also really like these. These I have never opened before, so I just got them. And the, love this one. It was sold out when I tried to get it. So, I mean, at the store, so I had to order it online. But finally got it. It is so, so cute. And from Ulta, I got these two things. This is the uh, Becca primer and I believe a blush. And I got this mainly to try this primer because I have tried, actually I'm using it right now, the purple one, and I've been really liking it. I don't know what it's called, It's it's the bottle is purple. But I really like it, so I wanted to try this one as well. I got that, and then I got this calendar, that like an advent calendar that I wanted to be opening during Vlogmas, but now I got here three days late. So, I'm gonna have to open one, two, and three. And what I wanted to do is actually try some of the makeup during this uh, vlogmas. Like whatever I open, I could try that same day. And I gotta tell you, these are all um, makeup from Ulta. Like it tells you here what it includes. And I have never actually tried any makeup from the Ulta brand. Like specific Ulta brand makeup. So I'm excited to try this. Yay! Okay, and let's see what's behind box number one. Okay, I might need two hands to open this. Got it open. What's this? It is a metallic lip gloss. That's pretty. Usually I'm not a fan of metallic lipsticks, but this looks like a really nice color. So for the second day, which would have been yesterday's, whoa, <laughs> that one fly. Again, this is kind of hard to open. Oh my God, second time, <laughs> that just happened again. <laughs> I'm trying to open this, but it goes flying. <laughs> that was kind of funny. All right, let me be more careful here. My husband's looking at me with a weird face. <laughs> Your full face. Okay, and here it is. What is this? This is a gel bounce eyeshadow And this is what the color looks like Seems like it has a lot of glitter and I know I said I could probably try these every day But since they one and one and two are already over anyway, I think I'm gonna save these for a giveaway And let's see what's behind door number three. Okay. Don't go flying, please All right See, they have these little things that 
It's just hard to take out. So on the third day of Christmas, Alta gave to me a Glitter Tears eyeliner. That's pretty. I mean, I like that. It's very uh, holiday appropriate. It's very gold and shimmery. I like it. I'm going to keep this one. I don't know if I'm going to be trying it today because I don't think I'm going to be doing my makeup today, but maybe tomorrow. And it is nine days until Christmas, by the way. Yay! What you doing? Oh, yeah. Coffee. Making me some coffee. Yum. I mentioned this in an Instagram story, but I got these. They're especially for the holidays this year. And let's see what we got. We got these. These are the orange ones. The snowball. Very these are the snowballs. They're not, there you go. <laughs> and then, what were these again? Licorice. Right, these were licorice. Doesn't taste very good. David doesn't like this one, I'm okay. Um, this one's orange, then these are the ones we normally get, which is caramel. This one's out of place. Goes here. Chocolate, and I have the vanilla right over here that actually, that usually goes here. But, I'm actually gonna put this one because we want to use these holiday ones. So there it is, our holiday coffee. Yay. You're ready for the holiday. <laughs> Perk up. Perk up. I'm going to relax for a couple of minutes and have this cup of coffee. And then I'm going to start cleaning up because this house is a mess. Seriously, I have like little messes everywhere. It looks like a warehouse. So David is calling the movie theater right now. He's in the room talking to them because we were gonna go watch Star Wars tonight, but since I'm not feeling too great, it's best to stay in and maybe watch a movie at home. These are all the things from uh, the giveaway and that's the big box. And this is the smaller box. These are the beauty items. And then here are the ears and the pants. I did this all well, we did in my Instagram today. So congrats to all the winners. I'm really, really excited to get these to you for Christmas, Christmas presents. So we've been cleaning up and right now we order some food. We got some ceviche. I love ceviche. What you get? Ají de gallina. Yeah, and we were trying to find a movie to watch. And I think we settle for this one, Fred Claus. I haven't seen it, you haven't seen it. Sounds like a winner to me. So I pulled out some of my favorite holiday movies to show you. And these are not all, but these are the ones that I have on DVD. And here you have A Christmas Carol. And this is the one from 1984, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 1984. This is the... Mickey's Christmas Carol and this one is really really cute, but It's not very long. I'm trying to look at the time here. It is. It's 58 minutes. So less than an hour I think that is great if you have kids because you know I think kids usually lose patience at some point. They don't like movies that are too too long, but this one this one is great this one I really love too more than this one actually I don't know this one even made me cry um, then again I'm a crier at movies I've mentioned that before it doesn't take much to make me cry at movies but I mean who cries with Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas I don't know but yeah I did um, especially in the second story they are there are three different stories um, yep you have them right here and yeah especially the second one made me cry but I think the third one did too um, these three are kind of comedies, but they're cute and love, love actually. If you haven't heard of it, it's like a cute movie, but I believe it's a comedy too. I mean, it has these funny parts and it's just a cute movie. The Santa Claus is like a classic and I actually love all three of them. I know some people don't like the second or third. I like all three. I have to watch all three every year. This is like my tradition. This one became a tradition after I met my husband. Believe it or not, I had never seen it before. And it's a wonderful life. It's a wonderful movie. I really, really love this movie. We now watch it every year. Same thing with this one. I had never seen it before. <laughs> this one is brand new, but we've 
watched it two years now. Last year we watched it with his parents because um, we went over there for Christmas. And this is this is pretty old. I forgot the year. Okay, well, I cannot find the year here for the life of me, but I remember it's from the 40s. Um, so it's pretty old. It is in black and white. I've been meaning to watch the newer one, which is like from the 90s, I believe. Um, so maybe I'll watch that this year. But this one I like. I, I love all of these movies. I try to watch all of these every year. It's tradition. Another one that we actually have on our Apple TV, we don't have them on DVD, it's Elf. I love Elf. We already watched Elf this year. Uh, another one is Home Alone as well. Love that movie. We already, uh, we actually saw the second part. We haven't seen the first one this year. Um, and I gotta say, I've been watching a lot of Christmas Hallmark movies this year. But anyway, these are some of my favorite holiday movies. Um, why don't you guys tell me some of your holiday favorite movies and if you don't see it here, maybe um, I can watch some new ones this year. So let me know which are your favorite holiday movies. So I mentioned in my first vlogmas I wanted to open these. So maybe my hubby wants to join me in opening these. Happy wife, happy life and all that good stuff. It's past midnight already. We're going to go to bed soon. I know it's been a slow day. Like we've been... Picking up and doing things. Not too exciting. Well, if it's past midnight, that means... Well, not yet, because the 8 one is for my next Vlogmas. <laughs> It'll be ready for you. So in Vlogmas number one, I mentioned that I didn't have very high expectations because the box came open, like without the tape. Mm. And then it seems like someone may have been messing with these. Mm. They felt them up, huh? Mm. Which is a risk that you run when you um, buy things off eBay. I feel like if there are chasers, people may want to take them out and do this. But then I think you can tell if, you know, there are little holes in the bag and stuff. But I still really want them. I think there are some really cute ones. I think I want... Well, I definitely want this one. I would want this one. What about you? I like the one with the cards. That's cool. Well, you first. Stuff. We'll see what you get. Dun dun dun. What's it gonna be? It's Ooh. the gold guy. That's a really pretty pin, though. It's a big pin, and it has like it's sh very very shiny. Batons. I think it has yeah. some like glitter. So that is very pretty. I'm impressed. It looks a lot better than the picture. What do you think? Yeah, really cool. Ooh, look. I really like that. Okay, let me see what I get. Maybe I'll be pleasantly surprised. Bing. And it is the bee. Okay, this one's okay. I'm not too crazy about it, but it's all right. But yeah, again, this has seven chasers and one super chaser. And I just got two of the regular ones. Coincidence? And the box had already been open. Hmm, I don't know. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? This one, I gotta say, I'm impressed with. I definitely like it. I will be keeping this one. Aladdin is one of my favorite movies. One of my husband's too. And by the way, I don't know if I mentioned it. These are the 25th anniversary mystery pins. Um, when we go to Disney World, if they still have them, I'm gonna be buying another one of these and hopefully I get a chaser. Um, either a chaser or this one I really like as well, but this one I'm very impressed with as I said and I really really like it So this one I think we'll be going for trading. It's really cute and if you look closely, let me see if I can um, It has some glitter in the back as well, but I don't know. I'm just not too too crazy about this one So David went to bed and I'm gonna go soon, but first I decided I want to take a bubble bath I am filling up the tub that usually takes a little while. I am sorry about the echo. There is some echo here in the bathroom. And today I'm going to be using this. I just got it a few days ago from Bath & Body Works, so perfect opportunity.
So this one turned the water a little bit opaque, but no fun colors like some of them that turn the water blue or pink. Um, this one does smell very nice though, I can tell you that. And I don't know if you're able to tell, it's not very lighting. You can see some oil on top of the water, especially here in this area. And it's because this is supposed to be moisturizing. Tub is ready. It actually smells very nice in here. Um, I got this water. It's just water, but I like it in this cup because it just makes me happy with little Minnie and Christmas. Mickey's on the other side. And then I got this candle. This candle is really, really good if you like uh, sweet candles. I don't think it's good for a long period of time, but for like 30 to 45 minutes you can handle it because it's a little strong, but it smells just like hot cocoa. So one thing I really love doing is to sit in the tub and watch some of my favorite YouTubers. I feel like when I just sit here and just stay quiet, I start overthinking and I usually end up thinking about work and things that I have to get done. So I rather just watch my favorite YouTubers and that usually brings more joy and more relaxation. Right now I'm watching Emily Noel. I love her channel. She has been posting over like the past seven days a bunch of videos and I've just been loving them. I think she's really great. So this is the video that I was looking forward to watching.